Hi guys and welcome back to The Sims. Um, I actually need a name for this still, like any suggestions you have, that would be great. Uh, now, I've made a couple of more Sims here, I'll get to the notifications in a minute. Uh, these are sisters here, so they should be, yeah they are. Um, this is, right here, is Gina Cunningham. Now, her traits are, loves the outdoors, bookworm, artistic, computer whiz and friendly and her lifetime wish is to be a professional author and her younger sister who is still a teenager has a good sense of humour, is a couch potato, genius and has a photographer's eye. Now I've just moved them into a flat, There's I've not really decorated it or anything yet, I will eventually get around to that but first off I want to try and get Gina a job here in the local school because I imagined her to be the, a teacher type. Oops, my volume of this is really loud. I'll just turn that down a bit. Um, now, where's the school? Over here. No, that's City Hall. There's the school. Uh, oh, what? Join education career. Now, we'll just skip time forward and I'll read these notifications here from Story Progression. Dave Staples and Adrian Coyle are now committed to each other. And that's it. Oh, I thought there would be more there. So let's zoom it back into her. Oh, God, it's so slow. Oh, wait. There we go. Uh, no notifications, they don't matter. Now, I'm not really sure what I want to do with the younger sister. Um, good sense of humour, couch potato, genius photographer's eye. I suppose she can be a sort of photographer sim. Um, quite like the, the eyes that I've put on her. Eyelashes look as if they're coming away from her eyelid though. Which is kind of annoying. Um, yeah, I think I might have her be the sort of photographer type. That could be interesting. Now, she wants to attend prom, so that's fine. She should probably do that. Um, don't know if there's any supernaturals in this neighbourhood yet that I've created. Learn writing skills, fine. I'm sure they can buy a rotten chair, but I really don't really mind. Uh, sure. She has so many wishes. In fact, I may take these two sims into the future. That could be fun. Now, I know that the future thingy my bob, which is obviously the technical term, time portal, I preferred my version of it, is here at Cassie's house that I still need to decorate the outside of, give it some more plants and foliage, make it look all lovely. Now, she can go inspect the portal. That's the only thing I don't like about story progression is you do get notifications of sims levelling up that you're not controlling. Whatever, it's fine. Accept. You have so much in common, I'd love to get to know you better. Oh, and Dave also got a job at the public school. And so did Karen. Wow. <laughs> Must be having a recruitment drive. Okay, hurry up. I want to go into the future. Oh, okay. Uh, no, I'm fine. Well, she got all dressed up in her formal wear. Why? I mean, I suppose for, it's an interview, but still. <laughs> okay. Jump in. Up. I want to go to the future. My dog is just rolling around on the ground right now. Um, can I not? I can't. Why can't? Why can I not? Oh wait. That's why I can't. Don't care if you're hungry. You can eat food in the future. 
hurry up. Uh, no. No, don't you dare go home. You're going into the future with your little sister. Except. Sugar was Mitchell creeped out when she caught former lover Tom Wardy hanging outside her house earlier. I think Tom needs to get himself a life or a hobby or anything to keep him off my property. And Wayne Bumble and Josh Thorpe have been drifting apart lately. Okay, um, did I hit a button there? Okay. Ugh, I never normally do these things because I'm always so bad at trying to find them. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't even attempt it. I should, um, so sometimes I'll do it, but it doesn't really bother me that much. My god. Like, I know what a cabinet is, and yet I just can't find it. <laughs> Come on, where are you? I'll click every single thing ever. No. Um, hurry up, just give me something else to click. Can't find it. Okay, what I think I'll do is just skip this bit and have them immediately go into the future because it's just awkward sitting here in silence. So I'll be back in a second. And we're back! Um, just hit yes. Some of our descendants have been located and live at 508 Precipice Parkway. Oh my god, my mouse is getting tangled up in my earphone wires. Ah, uh, sure. Don't know why I pressed there, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Like, pfft. I seen a button, I thought I may as well press it. Now, um, where's Gina here? She's still to come through. Thought she impaled herself in that there? Apparently not. Achieved the impossible. Watch your partners, everyone. Cassandra Chandelis is on the prowl for new meat. We might actually go visit their descendants, see what's happened. Map. Um, to be honest, I don't really use the, the future aspect of this game that much since I've bought the expansion, but it is it's very pretty, and I do like the clothes and everything that came with it. Um, sure. Felix Finn has arisen to the occasion to fight the scourge of frigid sims everywhere. All happening here in the future. Uh, where the hell do they live? Descendants, where are you? Okay. I can, I can never ever find him in the first glance. Over this way? No. Okay, come on. Where where are they? Um, it wouldn't come in their friends' homes, would it? Not that it would help me, because I still would not be able to find it. Oh my God! Come on. I do like the map of this place though. So I think it's just really, really nice. Um, come on, like, there's none of these houses here. The Obi household. Um, yeah, like, where are they? I wish I could just double click there and it would take me to the house. That would be nice. Hmm. It must oh maybe I never even noticed that bit. Okay. And no one's in, but who cares? We'll just stand there stalking, waiting on them. 
Well, that's kind of the usual stuff you would do if you go into the future. Okay, come on. Let's go. Some more notifications. Oh! There's been a marriage in the Cunningham family. And again, Cunningham Pit. The futuristic city of the Aces Landing. So we might slide. Eh, they're alright. Okay, come on, please tell me someone's home. Ah, yes. Come on. Oh. Oh, wait, are we crashing apart here? I think we are. Now, who's this? Cunningham Pit. So I think he must be one of the ones married in, possibly. Oops. We have so much in common, I'd love to get to know you better. And how about no? So who else have we got here? We have... Well, he's the one we just met, I think. Brooks Cunningham Pit. And we had a kid there, I believe. We do... Elena Pitt. I like the name Elena, it's quite nice. Uh, who else do we have in this house? Doesn't look like anyone else's home. Do not want to go down that hole. Well, we've got Rain. Lawrence. Met Elena. Other than that, it's not really a big family. Um, I'd like to see what rain looks like. Family ties. <gasps> Dude, what are you doing? Just, just, just kissing her? Like, oh, Sims. What are they like? Like, is that his kid that's standing right there? What? Well, standing right there now. What are they doing now? Shaka bra. Oh, wait, with a kid. Uh, please host an after party celebrating the recent epitals between Brooks and Rain. <gasps> you are married! The couple appear to be happy, though a bit dumbstruck. Cheater. Oh, 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 oh. And there's rain. I like what she's wearing. It's very futuristic. She looks kind of crazy eyed, but she's pretty. Uh, scuba diving? Okay, cool, cool. Watch out though, the government is keeping close tabs on you and will penalise you for infractions. Get hacking, get yourself a computer, and start poring over the code. Whoa, okay. So many notifications. None of these apply to my sims as far as I know. Go away! What's this little thing? You can play with it! I want to play with it! More, 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 more. Oh, well done, breaking your phone, idiot. Who's this that just ran in here? Lawrence. Yeah, I'm getting so many notifications here, oh my god. I think I might just take these people home, actually. Like, there's not really anything I can think that I want to do in the future. I just thought I'd take a quick look at what their descendants are. What's she doing? Just watching something. What's she watching? I don't know. That's cool. Oh, you can order some 
chocolate synthesized drink. Ugh, more notifications. Yeah, I'm just going to have to take these people home. Um, there's the little time thingy, machine, portal. What would you call it? There it's there. No, I've been away from it. There it's there. Travel back home. I'm feeling really tired today for some reason. Go away. Yeah, so I thought I would introduce you guys just to the, the two new sisters to move into the neighbourhoods. Um, I'm planning on just switching around the families that I'm playing every so often while I'm here. I know that cancels the, their wishes and stuff like that, but I don't, I don't really mind anyway. Hurry up and go home. Ah, now I know what a bar looks like. I don't know what a bar looks like. Come on. Okay, no, I'm not doing it. Anyway, yeah, this is just a quick part to introduce you into the Sims that I... Well, I made them the other day. Oh, yeah, now now you do it. Now you do it. Um, Yeah, I made them the other day, but I've only really just loaded them into a house. So thank you so much for watching. I love you all. I hope you all have an amazing day. Bye.